News now a Facebook post by a local teacher's advocate is making the rounds on social media and generating lots of debate. It is a picture of an unidentified Teloso Midway student wearing a shirt that has the Confederate flag prominently displayed. Our Brian Burns looked into the complaints today. Brian. Well, Joe, the picture shows a shirt worn by a student at Teloso Midway of a Confederate flag, which has been considered a racist symbol. And the post says the T-shirt was being worn by a student in the cafeteria of Teloso Midway High School. The picture was taken back in January, but Dr. Nancy Vera, teacher and president of the American Federation of Teachers, posted the picture today, saying in her social media post, I'm disgusted. Vera says the shirt shows the need for sensitivity training for that student and all students in local school districts. When they wear t-shirts such as that, it's an in-your-face type of thing. And uh, especially when he said, learn your history. Well, many of us do know the history of the United States and slavery and the plight of the African American. And that's not something we take lightly. We reached out to Teloso Midway Interim Superintendent Rodney Sumner, who says the school in no way condones the student wearing that shirt and that it violates the school's strict dress code. We've got a really, probably one of the strictest dress codes in Corpus Christi, and uh, my administrators do a good job enforcing that. Uh, but I'm not going to say that at any given moment someone may be wearing something or doing something they should not do. But when it comes to our attention, we'll deal with it and we'll administer discipline consequences. Sumner says he's disappointed that the photo came to light three and a half, half months after it happened, but they are looking into which student may have worn that shirt. Vera says she doesn't know why the person who sent her the picture waited so long to send it, but does believe in the photo's authenticity. She hopes the school district will consider sensitivity training for the entire student body. Joe? Okay, Brian, thanks.